Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys are doing well and let's quickly see what VeChain is doing, okay? Because we know that VeChain has been just in this pattern, okay? But uh, let's see what it's doing. And whenever it break this uh, support line, it's been struggling, okay? And you can see that it's trying to come up. It had it's recently tried um, really um, with some power but it re got rejected okay and now if you go to the lower time frames you can see that it is making something of a bearish pattern okay okay I, I can show it to you where it's getting rejected right from here actually okay right from here okay where you can see it had these rejection points right over here it bounced but then it broke it towards the downside so a lot of people are selling at this area but I mean it's still a good price. I mean, you know, for accumulation because you can see we did get some, you know, volume, but then it started dying. So that that tells you that people were selling at that point. Okay. Now, if you take this and just put it right over here. Okay. One good thing about this is it's making lower high structure, and I don't I don't count this because this was just a yeah uh, you know um, a little bit of a relief rally in the four hourly okay even if we go in the daily you can see it's making lower high structure okay so now if it can come up you know break this level 55 is also coming in in the four hourly break that break this resistance then we can have a little bit of a uh, change of sentiments that price has started to move towards the upside okay but this support just watch out for this support if it breaks it yeah the price will come down it will actually come down to let's test it okay yeah it will come and test this low over here okay exactly so now uh if you go in the monthly uh, weekly time frame let me show you something like I said, we were in this pattern. But if you go in the monthly time frame, as you can see, this is out of this resistance. In the monthly, uh, it, it makes a little bit of a you know better sense that you can see it is actually in this pattern. Okay. So this is quite a bit of a legit pattern where the price is going to do something like this. Okay, maybe come up, you know, go over here, maybe hit like that okay and make a reversal pattern and eventually break out because <laughs> in the monthly time frame we are below this level so chances are if we don't close above this level we can come further down okay so just uh, keep that in mind because uh if it comes down, hits this level, I mean, it's going to just bounce really. If I, that's what I feel because it, that's a great accumulation zone. Because even if you take the Fibonacci and just measure this move, you know, right over here, you can exactly see where the 1.272 level is. It's sitting right over here. Okay. And you can also see this low is where region is sitting at right now. Okay. So keep this in mind. If it can close over here, that's great. Uh, but I would like to see it get above this yellow line, okay? Even if it does close here, maybe we can have a little bit of a rally to, towards the upside because we did have one, two, three monthly closes in the red. Look at this. And well, this is a good sign that it's losing volume at the moment, but we still have one day and one hour left in the monthly close. So keep an eye on this. If it can at least be above this high, that's good. But I would really like to see it get above 0 0.05667, okay? But uh, let's see what happens. But, but this is your strongest support point. It can surely wig down to 2806, okay? If it comes down, a lot of people will try to get uh, make the price go towards the zero point uh, at this support line. Okay, so keep this in mind. Okay, 
but yeah guys this is it for vchain uh this is what i see in the charts i mean a downwards trend at the moment but hopefully if this monthly candle can get above this uh, yellow line we can a little bit of a relief rally to the upside maybe change direction break that break this white line uh resistance line and then maybe have a shift in the momentum because if it does that you can also see something like that play out okay okay where we have this a bullish inverse head and shoulder pattern if that i mean that we can talk for later on uh we'll see what happens in this um coming monthly close and what happens in, at the open okay thank you so much guys have a good day like my video subscribe to my channel and comment below bye bye